What is cracking everybody and welcome to another good cracking reactions video where today uh, we have a wonderful one for you guys. I'm uh, your resident reactor tonight or Nell Pearson alongside my man Devin Brevin the dude. How you doing? I'm doing. You're cheers, doing, brother. Dude. Hey, fucking cheers this dog. Mm, mm. Is that a white claw? <laughs> no, it's a Celsius. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this is Bob like, White damn. Claws, fucking nine. I know. Uh, I was I was gonna be like, really? <laughs> it's like Life's this hard. early. <laughs> I was like, damn. It's it's like yeah, man. It's nine twenty in the morning. I saw I saw a homegirl on uh on Facebook this morning who was like date left early because he, <laughs> I think he got grossed out. I chug half a four loco, and I was like, that's exactly why. That's exactly why. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy bitch. Uh, anyways, guys, uh, today we have something that me, Devin, and all of you at home have been waiting a very, very long time for. This morning, we got the heads up that, hey, the Acolyte trailer is fucking here. And we were like, bro, neither of us are working today. Let's fucking do it. So we are here for you guys. Devin, are you fucking hype, dog? Dude, I'm hype. I've been waiting to see this. I've been like keeping my expectations kind of low and not mm. like fanboying about it. Like I, I did with like, I fanboyed the shit out of Ahsoka. I I wanted Ahsoka forever and I got it. And I was, I was very, very pleased with it, God, but no. I've been waiting for this because this is supposed to be a perspective from the dark side, right? Our mm. main characters are supposedly supposed to be the villains of this saga. So mm. I'm really stoked to see uh, what we're going to get out of this. And I too am stuck, my friend. And without any further ado, let's fucking do it. Baby boy, this is the Acolyte trailer. Let's go. Close your eyes. Your eyes can deceive you. We must not trust them. Tell me what comes into your mind. This is so hype already. I know, it already looks good. Life. Balance. I see fire. Someone is killing Jedi. It doesn't make sense. What happened? I sensed darkness. Oh my god. This isn't about good or bad. This is about power, and who is allowed to use it? What is that? Let's go, dude! Oh, yeah! June 4th! June 4th! Devin, my dude! My dude! Oh, Dude, shit, this brother. actually looks sick. Okay, so let's let's talk about some of this here, right? Okay, yeah. so we have a lot of things. First off, Trinity from The Matrix is in this. Yeah, uh, yeah. and I'm mega hyped for that. I think that she looks, she fits the bill fucking beautifully in this. Um, I did not realize how Jedi they were going to be making this show. Uh, I knew that it was, yeah, it was going to touch on some. I did not know they were going to be like, oh, yeah, this is going to be hella Jedi focused. Um, yeah. Dude, <laughs> this is. So it this, looks. Go, go, go for like it. The, this, the way they're sort of handling this in, in this light of like this ninja person. I mean, because here's the deal, right? The Jedi are notoriously known to be inspired by samurai um in kurosawa films things like that um so to have the jedi facing off against this like random ninja ass person is one so sick super fucking dope um but two this entire like little ending thing 
where they're popping off. We still don't know who this person is, this person that's taking yeah. out these Jedi. Uh, it, it, it gives murder mysteries like almost slasher to me. Like where it like it fe- it feels like there's this there's this underlying imminent threat at all times, and I love that for Star Wars content. Did you see Daphne Keen at all in this trailer? Because Daphne Keen is one of the main stars of this. The um, X thirteen from Logan. Right, right, right. I don't think that I saw her. She. I get. I don't either. I think she is the the Sith. I think the ninja character we saw is a different character. I think mm. she's the Sith acolyte. Daphne okay. King okay. is. Yeah, that'd be dope. That'd be dope. I think she fits that bill really well, actually. Yeah, I'm. 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 I'm sitting here trying to look for the choreographer. Um, Still no luck. Yeah, it's it's you. just it's not coming up like right oh, away. Okay. So right. Daphne Keen is in eight episodes, and this is an eight episode series. Um. Amanda Stenberg, she's the assassin that we see right yes. there. That's, yeah, that's her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and she looks fucking dope. She looks dope as shit in this. Yeah, um, yeah. Carrie Ann Moss, that's Trinity. Yes. Um, God, I fucking love her so much, dude. She's yeah, so good. Yeah. Oh, oh man, yeah. I, I don't... Okay, I found the all cast and crew. Uh, maybe yeah i mean either way if it's not gonna be easy to find we'll 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 be able to find it again later in the future that's okay um dude we have tons of lightsaber colors lots of cool shit going on in this what what are your thoughts are does this get you mega hype does this continue to amp this up for you yeah and so this is supposed to be set during the high early high republic early Mm. high republic Mm. this is this is supposed to be the first sith and you kind of you like the the emergence of the first sith right right that's that's what the scene that one red lightsaber versus what what was that like, it was like eight? eight yeah like yeah, eight lightsaber. yeah and dude. then that force push uh-huh. with all the debris and everything that like i want to see more cinematography looks great um it looks like they definitely used a budget for this it looks like they're going all in uh, you know, we've talked about how, like, we've seen, uh, besides, like, Loki, the uh, Lucasfilm, like, the Star Wars properties, it seems like it's been getting more cinematic as we get into it, right? And I feel like our our first recognition of the cinematography for these Star Wars, yeah, shoot, that was just nuts. It's <laughs> um, so the, good. Of, it's so good. <laughs> of, 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 like, Star Wars is like, I, th- I feel like it really hit once we watched Andor, right? Right. Because, like, Mandalorian for that first season, I would even argue the second in Boba Fett. It kind of was like, oh, okay, you know, I was like, yeah, TV show. This is sick, but TV show, right? Right. Now this just feels like an elongated movie, and it it just it looks so good. Um, I feel like they're hitting the costume designs right. The scenery looks good. They're doing a really good use of practical and uh, visual effects, from what I could see just off of first glance. I'm I'm stoked to see this show. Dude, I I very much am too. I I think I'm most excited about the casting choices that they made. Mm -hmm. Because Carrie Ann Moss being this dope badass Jedi is perfect. Lee Jung Jae from uh, the notorious um, wonderful Netflix show. (laughs) Um, God damn, why am I coming over the blank there? Um, God damn it. God damn it. Uh, Squid Game. Um, Being Mm -hmm. in this. And he looks awesome in this. Being a Jedi Master looks fucking great. Um, yeah. The I I think I think also too kind of diversifying the way the Jedi look uh, to give them each their own personality is a very good choice as well. Um, because obviously, like you mentioned, this is very early in High Republic stuff. So like, there's there's not a whole lot of like Jedi shit that we like know about at this point. Right. And so like, it's cool to see them sort of diversify in like the species and races and looks overall, because if you remember one of our favorite parts of like old school star Wars games is having the Jedi like masters all sort of like look different. And that was like dope for what it was. I'm really excited Mm -hmm. for that. Um, dude, I like, I think Daphne Keith probably are Sith in this. 
I, th- I think she is too I so. and i think that's very fitting honestly i think she, she she's gonna be i don't think she's gonna be the main sith though i Ooh, think this okay. is gonna be the introduction of a big bad the old republic sith, right you know right um and and you know another thing to note the upcoming game actually canon too um they've they've announced that they're not diverting off of off of canon anymore with right. any video game we see that a lot with fallen order and you know jedi survivor and stuff right yes so i'm wondering if this is going to have any tie-in with that game it could to think it yeah. Could. yeah yeah i mean like I, I, it's not far-fetched man i mean they they could even if it's just like mm-hmm. some character like exact tie-in who knows man uh but it's it's really really Cool to think about. Devin, any final thoughts? Go check out our podcast and um, hear from it from us from there. Uh, but we'll we'll certainly find out because choreographer looks like it's it's going to be dope. It's going to be dope. I think I might have found it. It's a stunt coordinator. OK, right? does that sound right? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Stunt coordinator Mark Ginther. Mark Ginther. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'm going and seeing what they... Oh, dude, it's a stunt coordinator from Shang-Chi and the oh, Legend of Ten Rings. Oh, dude, let's Iron go. Man. Let's go. And Mighty Morphin Power Rangers and Transformers. <laughs> let's fucking go, dog. I'm here for uh, it. And the Kingsman. Oh, even and better. Kingsman. Yeah, even better. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. And, well. Daredevil, and Daredevil TV series. <laughs> that makes like, sense that's that's dope that's yeah super dope all right guys well that's uh that's gonna be it for us i think we uh we did our talk in here we're excited to see more of the alkali uh when it comes out in june uh this show is gonna be sick uh i think both of us are mega fucking hype for this all of us here are good cracker are mega hype for this and uh we're excited to see more uh devin thank you for doing another wonderful trailer reaction and uh for all of you at home come check us out uh we hope uh you guys enjoyed this and uh we'll be back for another trailer reaction uh sometime soon so until next time my friends be good to each other later y'all